What's going on everyone and welcome or welcome back to the channel where today I'm over at Jack in the Box to check out the latest sweet treat they've got on the menu for a limited time only. That's right and as you already know I'm hopping aboard the Pineapple Express so stay tuned because it's up next. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian K. Stay frosty. So here we go guys, the Pineapple Express shake here at Jack in the Box. And as you're gonna see, a very frosty cup of sweet looking goodness, guys. I have to say, this is looking very golden and very, very chilly in my hands at the same time. All right, so apparently what's in this, based upon what I was told, is a pineapple type of flavoring, a powder of some sort that actually is blended with vanilla soft serve and then topped off with whipped goodness, of course, and a cherry. Guys, you gotta have the cherry on top, right? So it's definitely got the right accent on top of that nice yellow color, guys. And on a cold day here in Southern Cali right now, this is very frosty in my hands. Yes, sir, and as this begins to melt down, that little cherry is beginning to make its way down to the bottom of this. But as you can see, very cool looking in terms of the accent on this, guys. And again, a very chilly day here in Southern Cali. So without further ado, let's knock this one out right now. It's the all new Pineapple Express Shake here at Jack in the Box. Let's do it. Mmm. Super thick but super rich. Wow. Crazy sweetness. Very heavy on that vanilla and the pineapple together. It's a pretty nice combo so far. Mmm. I can barely get this up the straw, guys. So as you can see, the coloring, it's pretty nice on this. Plenty of the whipped cream goodness on the very top. Let me go for that just a little bit here. Look how thick this is. The straw is lit up with this goodness, guys. This is really nice. Mmm. Super rich, super vibrant, and as this cherry begins to go down, I might as well take this down really quick, guys, as you can see. Let's give it a shot. Hang on. Mmm. Absolutely. Nice accent. Let's keep going. Mmm. I can barely get this thing up. It is very, very strong in the thickness department. Hang on. Mmm. It goes good with that cherry though, really nice. So yeah, the sweetness is definitely up there guys and considering the size that I've got here right now, this is more than enough. This is actually a regular for 429, the largest 479 out here, but this is all you really need. Very, very cool in terms of what this is actually offering over here at Jack. And I gotta be honest, the first time I saw this, I immediately thought of Pineapple Express the movie with Seth Rogen and James Franco. But on the real, the backup thought was actually the Pork Chop Express. And if you know exactly where that's from, the big, huge, huge freight liner that was driven by Jack Burton in a very popular 1986 movie, drop those comments down below. Let me know which movie that is. It's actually one of my all-time favorites. So Jack, if you're watching this, I think you're missing the boat slightly by pairing this up with a Pork Chop Express type of entree to go with the Pineapple Express. I think it's a pretty nice combo. But as it stands for this shake, it is very, very sweet but the flavoring is pretty nice. I'm not getting really Dole Whip vibes from this. It's more like the artificial pineapple type of flavoring, but even still, it really is very, very strong, along with the vanilla goodness from that soft serve that it's mixed with. And naturally, with the whip topping on the very top here, guys, you can't fade that. Pretty nice. All right, so let's go for a couple more sips on this one, guys, because the right side of my face is beginning to freak out. It's very, very sweet, but the pineapple is pretty good. Powder or not, I thought it was maybe like a syrup of some type. I guess it still gives you the color either way. Very, very cool. And naturally, this actually looks very cool up on the poster in front of the restaurant as well, too. So another couple of sips. Hang on. Mm. I can barely get this up through the straw, but it's super flavorful, what I am getting, actually. Wow. That is crazy. Order on Uber Eats, Postmates, and Grubhub. All right. I think I'm good with this right now. Very tasty, a very cool sweet treat over here, Jack, to go with. And naturally, again, I think that should pair up nicely with just about anything on their menu. On its own, very, very sweet. But like I said, guys, you'd expect that the powder that's mixed in with that is very, very strong in the pineapple department. So it really is a pineapple express because I am running all over the place. It feels like right now because the sugar level is crazy. But at the same time, I'm digging what I've got here. Price point, decent at $4.29. But like I said, that's all you really need. Just get the regular. All right, so with all that said, I'm gonna have to give the pineapple shake over here at Jack in the Box a pretty decent seven out of 10. I'm not gonna go much higher than that, and I'm definitely not gonna be getting this one again because although I do love Dole Whip, this is kind of giving me little shades of pineapple goodness in the background in terms of what that is, but this is very strong in that vanilla soft serve department with the pineapple goodness coming up, but overall, very, very sweet. And again, one last time, you gotta love the whip topping on the very top of this here, along with that little maraschino cherry. Very, very lovely situation. You gotta have one of those. It really looks great on the poster. And guys, super fun to check out either way.
All right, so do me a quick favor. For all of you peeps that have Jack in the Box in the area, if you do give this one a shot, which I'd recommend trying it at least once, and if you've actually had the Dole Whip float in the past anywhere else where they may serve something like that, how do you think this actually compares to that? Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Yep, sugar overload on this one, but you'd expect that. And considering the flavor is definitely delivering that pineapple goodness on top of the vanilla goodness that this is mixed with, guys, yeah, a very lovely situation, especially again with that cherry on top along with the whipped cream. Pretty awesome. All right, guys, until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Hey, thanks for checking out another one of my reviews. But just in case you didn't see the one before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's gonna recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya. Thank <laughs> you.